Question number three says that find the value of the division in each of the given bits. Before we get on to the division and the solid part of each bit, what we have to understand is whenever a number is divided by a number which is a power of 10, the decimal moves towards right as many places as there are zeros in the number which is a power of 10. So starting with we have 2.7 which is to be divided by 100. So the decimal moves two places towards right. So the answer for this bit will be 0 0.027. Coming to the second bit we have 0 0.3. So the decimal again moves two places towards right and the answer for this becomes 0 0.03. Coming to the third bit we have 0 0.78 which is divided by 100. So the decimal moves two places towards right. So our answer for this bit will be 0 0.0078. Coming to the fourth bit we have 432.6 divided by 100. Now the decimal moves two places towards right and now is between 4 and 3. So the answer for this bit is 4.326. Coming to the fifth bit, we have 23.6 which is divided by 100. Moving the decimal two places towards right gives us the answer as 0 0.236. Coming to the last part which is the sixth part of this question, we have 98.53 which is divided by 100. So we will have to move the decimal two places towards right and the answer that we get is 0 0.9853 and this is how we solve this problem. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.